there is so much happening. Um, on destruction especially, it's uh, looking like various forms of plasma are looking positive. We're seeing the potential to create these species called hydrated electrons, which can also break down PFAS in solution. We're seeing supercritical water, you know, 374 degrees C and about 200 bar pressure as working effectively. And there's some techniques which are using lower temperatures and pressures, but um, raising the pH, the hydrothermal alkali. But from a research perspective, we're seeing sonication or sonolysis, high frequency ultrasound working really effectively on PFAS. We're seeing ball milling as potentially being appropriate. We're now seeing really viable solutions that are gonna be commercially available for destruction of PFAS on site. I think they're ready to go over the next few years. There'll be a huge number of pilots and full scale systems using innovative technologies to destroy PFAS.